back to my channel. So the Dollar Tree haul for you guys, it's kind of big. Um, I got a lot of multiples of things. So we're just gonna jump right into this. I'm gonna start with the boring stuff and then we'll get into the more exciting stuff. So I stocked up on my rice. They were all out of Spanish and the 99 cent store was all out of Spanish as well. So I picked up four of the chicken and then I got two more of the 40 count of paper plates. We're completely out of syrup. I made French toast the other night for dinner because my husband doesn't always get breakfast. Um, and I really didn't feel like cooking like a big meal, you know, and the kids love it. So we had like this much syrup and I was like, oh my God, <laughs> like we need to get one. So I just got it while I was at Dollar Tree. It's just the original pancake syrup, 24 fluid ounces. So I got another one. I went ahead and got this big thing of ketchup. Um, it's two pounds. We go through a lot of ketchup because of my, my husband and the kids. And then tonight we're gonna have pizza. So I got one pizza jar, pizza sauce jar, wow. And two crusts, because I usually make two because um, one is usually not enough. So I did pick up two of them. I got these for Jan. I'm going to freeze them and I will send them to her in the next package. These ones are cinnamon raisin. Oh, they smell so good. If I don't get into them before that, but I don't think I will. I'm gonna put these in the freezer for you. I just sent her a bag of bagels in this package that she should be getting on Monday. So really excited about that. Um, I'm almost out of paprika, so I got just a big thing of it. It's 3.17 ounces. I got my husband a box of frost, frosted blueberry. Um, this isn't the one that I needed to get. He has like three boxes down there, but that's okay. And then my kids got into this one this morning. Um, and it's the frosted strawberry. So, got those found only one lonely bag sitting there. This is the resealable Jewy, Jujuy fruits. I don't even know if I said that right. It's 10 ounces. So to get this big, it's not big, but I mean like this is a big bag for a dollar. And you get lime, raspberry, lemon, orange, and anise. A nice anise right here. So that's right up his alley. He'll love that. I also got two bags of the soft and chewy bites Mike and Ike's because me and my husband both like these. And then the kids wanted just regular sour bright crawlers if my husband doesn't get into those. And then I got a bag of snaps so that way I'm prepared for when I need to do my pretzels before I leave. Which I gotta start like figuring out what day I need to have all this stuff done. So I got four boxes of these. I didn't feel like showing you four of them, so I just grabbed one. Um, but you get six sour candy canes and you get black cherry, blue raspberry, and green apple. And I wanna throw one of these in each of the goodie bags for my husband's coworkers. Like I've said, Christmas is the one where I tend to do more goodies than just the regular holidays. So I wanted to throw in one of these. So I got four boxes because I don't know how many bags we're making and we'll eat the leftover ones. So it's not a problem. And then I got two of the Sunny D 40% more. I always grab these when I see them. Um, so I got two of them to put in the fridge for the hubby. And I got two boxes of these Minion cookies. I saw these on Instagram and I was like, oh, I really hope I find them because these go for way more at Walmart and Target and stuff like that, your grocery store. It's just a 10 ounce box. I actually got three and one of them is gonna go to my sister-in-law's house because she loves Minions. Or it's not gonna go to her house, it's gonna be saved for her Christmas present and the kids will just throw that into her uh, Christmas present because she loves Minions. And I never gave her the little Minion figure figures that my G sent me for her because I didn't know where I had put them. So those are gonna go in her bag for Christmas as well with a box of these. So I got three of them, but one of them is over there. 
And then that's it for food. I got a box of the quart zipper storage bags. You get 20 in here. They were all out of gallon size, but I got some at the 99, so I'll do that in a separate haul. And then I got these. Um, they're the Good Sense Handles trash bags, and they smell like vanilla. You get 10. I want to keep this box out on the patio next to my little trash can that I have there. Um, so that way I can, they'll be right there. So that's what I got those ones for. I got another thing of sponges. I got one thing of fabric softener and the vanilla that I always get. My mom is having a hard time finding these big soap refills. Um, so she asked me if I see them at Dollar Tree, the 99 cents or at the 99 to pick them up for her. And I got four of this kind. She said she didn't want like the milk and honey one. She didn't, she said if it was like lemon or something, then that's fine, but they didn't have it. So I got her four of the spa soap antibacterial liquid soap refill and it's 32 fluid ounces. So I got her four of those. I'm going to take them with me when I go home for Christmas. And then I got one pack of the command strips, the command strips. Um, you only get four in here and then they only had one left of this size. So I got, I got that. I have a little jar that kind of looks like this. It actually has a lid and I have my glue sticks sitting in it and it's really hard to reach my hand in there. So I saw this one and I thought maybe it'd be easier. I do have a glue gun holder that I made, but since I have Christmas decorations on that little bookshelf, there's no room for my glue gun holder right now. So once Christmas is over, I will use my glue gun holder and it has a little section for the glue sticks. But right now, I would rather them just be in this little glass dish. And then when I don't need it, I can use this for candy or whatever. So boring story, but that's what I got this for. I got two more of these because I was like, oh, I'm wh what if I want to make one of these for Valentine's Day or 4th of July or St. Patrick's Day to put in my little box because that's where I have it right now and it looks really cute. So I got two more. I think I have two in my bin that I didn't use. So that's a total of four that I will have to reuse. So I got these for DIYs. I got some poster stickers. You get 56, it's the alphabet. So I got two more of those for DIYs because this is what I use for my um, red truck sign. Uh, I did get a few more things for gifts for my kids. It was only a dollar. So Shannon actually saw this and she wanted it. So it's just a little doctor kit, medical kit play set. You get five pieces. So I love that they had a blue one. So obviously if he sees her pretending to be a doctor, he's going to want to be one too. So you get one stethoscope, one injector, one thermometer, one tweezer, and one scissor. So I'm going to wrap these and put them under the tree. So they'll each get a little doctor set. And then I found these that come with brushes and paints. So I got him the Tonka. Um, and then I got her Minnie Mouse. So I'm gonna wrap those as well and put those under the tree. Just cute little things like that. It's, I mean, it's a dollar, so there's no room in their stockings, so that'll be perfect. Um, I don't remember who it was. Somebody was talking, I think it was Jeanette over at Frugal J. Hey mama, I think it was you that was talking about this. This giant gift bag that you were saying that somebody else that you were watching mentioned to using this for cleaning up wrapping paper for Christmas when you open gifts. That's such a great idea. So I'm taking one of these to my mom's house because there's going to be a lot of kids. A lot of us, we're not all going to want to clean up. So, and then I will keep this one here for when we wrap, open uh, Christmas presents here at my house. So I got two. This one has Santa and snowmen and reindeer and penguins. And then this one has the red truck so I thought it was cute so I'll probably take this one to my mom's and we can use this to just throw all the trash away I know my mom has garbage bags but this is just it's festive and it's cute it was only a dollar so I got it 
I know, I didn't need to do that, I'm extra. I needed boxes for my nephews for one of their gifts because it's shaped weird and I don't have any boxes to just put it in to wrap a box. So I saw these and you get three of them. And I actually wanna know what the other one looks like. But there's the dinosaurs. And then you get the llamas with the cactuses. And then there's sloths. So I'll probably use the sloths and the llamas for my nephews. And then I'll save this one for Leland because it's dinosaurs. And then when I was looking at the tissue paper, because I need tissue paper for the inside of the boxes, I have like red and green left over. But I saw these and I thought they were cute. Um, you get eight pieces, so you get four with the snowman, and then you get four green. But I really liked the snowman design, I thought it was cute. And then this one has the red truck. Same thing, you get four of the red truck and then four red. So I can use that for the my nephew's gifts. And then for my sister-in-law, Shannon saw this gift bag and she was like, Mom, I wanna get it for, she calls her PB. And she's like, I wanna get it for PB. And I was like, okay. So I'll put one of the minion boxes in here and I'll probably put her whole gift in here or this will be just from the kids to her and then whatever we decide to get her we'll give it to her separately um because I still don't know what I'm getting her I was going to order her something but I didn't I'm probably just going to get her gift cards so I might just throw them in here but this is what this side looks like and then the front has the cat wearing a Santa hat so got her that bag last few things um Shannon wanted this unicorn. It's really soft and cute. She actually found it in an aisle where it didn't belong. So she wanted that, I told her it was fine. And then her and her brother each got one of these little robots. Leland got the T-Rex and it did have a tab, but he pulled it out. So if you push this black button on his tail, um, he makes a t-rex sound it's really loud and annoying so i want to push it and my son is napping right now so he got the t-rex and then shannon got the dog and it just barks uh same thing it has the black button right here so they each got a little robot i needed more cotton balls and more q-tips and i like i know you can get the 300 but i always say i don't like the plastic ones i like the cotton in the middle for when I'm cleaning my ear. I don't like it when it bends, bug me. I got one of these wet wipes just because I always pick them up when I see them. You get 40 in here. I got this Lucky Super Soft Kiwi Melon Revitalizing Hand Soap, 13.5 fluid ounces. I love anything Kiwi Melon, it smells amazing. Oh, it smells like summer. Oh, so I'm gonna save this for summertime, but I saw it there and I picked it up. I also got this eyeshadow brush by Sashi, Sassy and Chic. I just love the gray handle on it. And then I got the blush brush to use for my nails when I am filing to get the powder off. I also got this little gray trash can because the one in my bathroom is cracked. So I need to chuck it. And this was, it's not going to match, but that's okay. It's just a trash can. So just got that. I was hoping they had black, but they didn't. And then I got these uh, cosmetic brushes and they come in the little pouches. These are being saved for friend mail. Uh, this one has marble handles. I thought it was really pretty. And then this one has color uh, cheetah on it. So I got one of each. Those are for friend mail. I got this LA Colors Color Craze Nail Polish in Delicate. It's a really pale pink. I might give this to my sister, but she told me to stop giving her pink nail polishes. <laughs> She's like, I do like other colors. It's like, well, everybody gives me orange, so you know, that's how it is when it's your favorite color. I found green and black plaid buffalo check fabric. So I got two rolls for St. Patrick's Day. I might use this on one of these. If not, 
then I will find a different DIY to use because I did get paper at Hobby Lobby that has four leaf clovers so I might use that for one of the mason jars or I can use one of these but you guys already know I love fabric I might make a trivet for St. Patty's Day so since I'm in that funk of making trivets for every season now and it's hard to find the trivets again because as soon as I mentioned it everybody started going out and buying them so if you guys remember I hauled the Tom and Jerry video in my last Dollar Tree haul. Um, I'm gonna wrap that and put it under the tree. And Leland saw this Batman one and wanted it. So I'm gonna wrap this one and put it under the tree for him. So they'll each get a movie. Cause I initially just put it in our cupboard where we keep all of our movies. And, but now that I have one for him, I can wrap them and they can open them. Cause I did get movies at Walmart on Black Friday, but I already wrapped those. So I'll just add this under the tree. I got this puzzle, it's 500 pieces, and it has Ariel, Aurora, Belle, and Cinderella. I just think this is really pretty, so I want to get into this and do this, so I got that. Last two things, I have a picture frame um, with a picture of my kids with their cousins. It's the, like, it's the most up-to-date picture I have of them. And I have it in a frame that isn't meant to go sideways. It's meant to go up and down and it always falls over. So I want to put it, I want to take that photo out and put it in this one. And it says family, a whole lot of love. I love the white and the black. So it's a four by six. You can hang it, but it is meant to stand this way. So that's why I got this one. And then my father-in-law's Christmas present came in and it's a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be, so I want to give him something else with it. So I'm going to print a picture out of my kids and put it in this one and then add it to his gift. Uh, it just says, begin each day with a grateful heart, and then it has the brown. They also had a gray one, and I don't remember what it said, and then they had like a bluish gray one as well. And they were putting it on a display for like last minute gifts. So they were just putting these out when I grabbed them. So that's it for this Dollar Tree haul, you guys. It was really big. I was excited to find um, those picture frames, the puzzle, and to get soaps for my mom. I was really happy that I was able to get it at Dollar Tree instead of spending more at Walmart or the grocery store. So stay tuned. I'm gonna have plenty of other videos for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I would love for you to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.